Hello friends, today we will be doing Math Kangaroo level 5 and 6 year 2024, question number 19. This is a four pointer question. Let's read the question. Christian has cut four small squares from the corner of the larger square so that the remaining area is half of the area of the original square. So they have cut four small squares from the corners of a larger square so that the remaining area is half of the area of the original square. The side lengths of the small squares are shown in the diagram. What is the perimeter of the remaining shape? So now, what is the area of the squares? Because what they are saying is uh, that the remaining area is half the area of the original square. So that means this area, like here you have 4, 3 times 3 is 9, 6 times 6 is 36 and 1 times 1 is 1. So this area is actually half of the area of the square. So this will be 40 and then 50. So this is half. So area of larger square will be 2 times 50, which is 100. So if you're not getting a square number, like if it's a 90 or if it's not a square number, that means a calculation is wrong or our interpretation is wrong. So just redo this. So since area of the larger square is 100, therefore each side of the square will be uh, the larger square will be 10 because area of the square is side times side. So 10 times 10 will give me 100. So the dimensions of the larger square is 10, 10, 10, and 10. Now, what is it that we need to find here is uh, the side lengths are shown. What is the perimeter of the remaining shape? So this is the remaining shape that I have, the blue line. So let's just write the dimensions here now of the blue shape. So let's just use a black color. So now this is 2, this is 2. Now, this is 3 and this is 2. So, this length will be a 5. Then you have a 3, 3. This will be 3 and 6. So, this length will be 1. This will be 6. Now, this is 6. This is 1. So, this length will be a 3. 10 minus 6 minus 1 is 3. And now, this is 2 and this is 1. So, you'll do 10 minus 3 which is a 7. So these are the dimensions of the shape. So let's just add it. So I have, let's start from here. So I have a 2 plus 2 plus 5 plus 3 is 3 plus 1 plus 6 plus 6 plus 3 plus 1 plus 1 plus 7. So these are the dimensions of the remaining shape. Let's just quickly add it. So whenever we are adding these shapes, always look for numbers that add up to 10. So what we can do is, you can do 7 plus 3, 10. Uh, and then you have like 3 plus 2, 5. 3 plus 2, 5, 10. Plus 5, 15. And then I had a 10 here, so 25. And then I have a 25 plus 12, 13, 14, 15. So I have a 40. So what is the perimeter of the remaining shape? So the perimeter of the remaining shape is 40. That's the answer. Okay, uh, the other way, uh, yeah, so this is the way to do it. Uh, so B will be my answer. Thank you for watching. Do subscribe to my channel for more such videos.